When you go to a pool, you'll see 18 to 24 rules and regulations. And the most important, the most vitally important rules and regulations, those warnings that are going to keep guests happy and safe, are hidden between no smoking, no glass, no eating on the pool deck. There's only three or four things that we really want to emphasize at a swimming pool environment. The most important warnings, these warnings take care of 90% of the liability at the pool, are for parents to watch their children closely. If parents are reminded to watch their children and watch them actively, not passively in a lounge chair, but actively, the chance of drowning we know is significantly reduced. Secondly, another sign we want is that non-swimmers should wear life jackets. Even in shallow water pools that are five feet deep, a child under the age of 12 will drown if they don't know how to swim. We have to warn the public about not diving into water. You need a minimum of nine feet of water when you dive from a swimming pool deck to be perfectly safe. And one of the less frequently used signs in the United States, but it's probably the most important sign, is that we should not allow any extended breath holding for long periods of time, particularly when it's done many times over and over again. It's a combination of blowing off your carbon dioxide, which is the trigger mechanism to breathe, and then using up all your oxygen so that you cannot support consciousness. And so you black out, you aspirate water, and then you drown quickly. One of the problems with uh, hotels and resort type pools is theming and branding and color coding the signs that blend in with the ambiance uh, of the resort. And while this looks pretty and this is nice, it tends to camouflage the warnings. They have to come off the page and come alive rather than just blending in with the theme or, or the color coding of the hotel. You can take the most important warnings, use the appropriate shapes and colors, uh, and place them on a nicely done sign where the perimeter of that larger sign is themed to blend in with the ambience of the hotel or resort. All pools have a duty to warn um, because the water does present a significant hazard and risk to guests who are unaware. The data shows year in and year out that the number of people who drown in America is significant, about 4,000 people each and every year. We're not looking at minor injuries. We don't want to sign everything. If we sign everything, then a guest doesn't read anything. But we, we just want to warn against the big losses, against death, paralysis, and, and huge financial losses for that aquatic facility.